Baby. Baby. Anytime she come and she miss me. It's a mystery. Lord is mercy. I beg you when goes down to the girls. I'm going to own it, don't keep it, punk it. Said. I want to big up all the single ones. Them, the single woman, them, and the single man, them, and big up the single father, them, and big up the single mother, them. Big up all who do the co-parenting thing. Because... No, we in our time now, everybody will live them life. Relationship not really work out. But when it comes on to parenting, the co-parenting part of it, it's a big problem. It have to reach to the internet and you hear how the man are wicked and you hear how the woman are wicked and all of them something there. I have so much thing to say. That's why when I come on and I make sure I'm making sense. Sometimes you hear a little laughter coming out and it sounds funny, but they know at the end of the day it's going to be serious. You know? You know this, I have to keep myself hydrated and drink a lot of water. Because water is a cleanser. So you have to cleanse yourself. You know what I mean? Make sure you drink water. From my liquid, them say you must drink 8 gallons of water. But on a eight gallons, it's eight glass of water you're supposed to drink. How who can drink eight gallons of water? You know what is eight gallons of water? A whole heap. See? When me attack, I don't make no sense, I try to use a whole heap of big words. Because sometimes I use some big words, people don't have a business about your big words. The message people want to hear. Them now I hear no big word. Sight. I look on the internet again today. A girl sending in a voice note where she sent her baby father. She sent her baby father a voice note saying that um she asked him to pay half a day school fee because what is not being talked about is even though it's online classes if you don't pay your child won't get the link to do online classes the people them want their money the same way so she reach out to her baby father and ask him to pay half of the money. And the man sent her back a voice note and say, She must go ask Angel Olness for the money. You know, say Angel locked down the place. My girl, you call me and ask me about, about money. I have school fee. Don't ask me about no school fee. Go and ask Anjo. I don't know how to feel. Because some woman want the man to pay the whole height. But this mother asks for half. Just half. Obviously they are not together. And he send that to her. That she must go and to Anjo. Now you know being in the comments, a lot of people is going to get upset. Because they're going to say she and Andrew never did a lay down. You know what I mean? We are going through a rough time right now. It's an incredulous task. Now is not the time for the bickering back and forth with baby mother and baby father. Working amicable supposed to be the better way. All interests must be put in, into the child. Best interests. Because no child should be left out of school. 
No child should be left uneducated when they have working fathers and mothers. No child asks to be here. None. I sympathize with all mothers who are struggling. I sympathize with all dads who are struggling because you have some mothers who are doing better than the father and decide that she's not doing anything. Fuck you. Me and my man go to Dubai now, or me and my man go to Mexico now, or I just go do my surgery. I mean, I stop my, my thing for nobody. And, and uh, I understand. But when two people came together, they lie down, she gave him back shot, she gave him lizard lap, she go on him head, she ride on him, she go on with all type of things, she ride on it like a bicycle, she cock it up like a dumper truck and she says she has the beds on her hand. And the child come and now the responsibility is here and no one wants the responsibility. We are supposed to be molding young men and women for the future. The future dark. We are letting the internet grow our children. Remember, the internet can be very good and it can be very bad. It's doing more bad now to the generation now than good. Because if you look on the internet as grown people, we are grown people and enough time when we look on the internet, all we see is things to get us upset. We look on the internet and we see so much things that we say, Jesus Christ, how would a girl come out come do that? She not have no filter upon her mouth, she not have this, she not have that. Why she not rare? Why she not blah, right? She not lay, 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 lay. So this child is opening up to all of this. All of this, you know. Seeing? What is going to happen, I don't know. It's a grave concern. I saw a lady um, on the star page since week. Has two children, about eight years old, seven, eight, thereof. And they have a problem with online classes. Because they don't have no internet. They don't have no tablet. Them barely a struggle to find it to eat. Them barely can find it. So, when I go to Bam and I try to reach out, I get a number for them. And I try to call the number. No, I'll be a voice mail me again. Because where they live, the service no good up there. While you have some people, they have a child where they can do better. Have service of everything, but them no business of fuck education, they might the right to. Sin? Fuck education, they might the right to. What are we going to do, people? Youths of the future, the youths of today would be the man and the woman of the tomorrow. From my young, I've been always hearing that. Do you remember that? Do you remember when the music tell you that? Eh? Do you remember when the music tell you that? Rough. 
yesterday again me say a news a video where police sold three teenagers to firearm and some bush out of center must be she the coyote would have been son Like the police never kill them still. Other people say it should have been the other way around. Because they must say that them youth they are going to kill the people, they are going to go with all kinds of things. Sad. Sad, bad. Sad, bad people. I just have a bit of advice to give. All single people who don't get a child yet. You will not get in a child yet. There's no rush. Don't let nobody pressure in you into getting a child. I'm always going to say this. It's not an easy job to take care of a child. Especially if you're not financially stable. Especially if you're going to be doing it on your own. Getting the child is not the problem. Maintaining the child, putting in time and effort and energy and patience will be the task. If you can't stand to be around people, for more than half of you're not going to be able to have a child. You're not going to be able to maintain this child because you have to say you can't bother. What's the word? Correct me if I'm wrong. Force mortem depression. Is that the word? Somebody correct me if I'm, if I'm, if I'm wrong. That postmortem, postmortem depression, or if that's the word. When a woman have the baby and her body and her mind not really come into play yet, say she have a baby and a she push out this baby and a she have to deal with this baby she have got breastfeed the baby, she have got no lift the baby, she have got no how to wrap the baby, she can't shape the baby, she have got no all kind of things. And then when the baby cries and she don't know what to do, she probably might hurt the child. Worse, if she alone is dealing with this child. Worse, if the baby father say, hey, girl, move from there and go away. I say I'm a theme one and all is and them something there. It's not easy. I respect every young family, every young youth. I remember I get youth when I was young, but I was dedicated. At 18 years old, I was a dad. But at 18 years old, I should be out there fucking on the whole Jamaica. I look for catch all crab louse and all of them something there. Gonna ride and all of them stuff there, cause I just a fuck down the whole place. But me go get to man and pit me a family me go get now. I take care of four. I do man have two pit me for mine. See? So what me should I do now? Leave her with the, my two and her fear too. And gone. Cause me a young boy. I'm a few out the road and I flash it and dash it. I choose not to. I choose to be a dad. But not everyone will think like me. Not everyone will think like me. They would leave this child for the mercy of the world. That's why I tell her one, you know. Every way I live my life, if I could live it over, I would change some things. I would change some things. See? 
You have more teenage pregnancy now more than ever. Because everybody hormones is running super wild. If the sun too hot, if the sun too hot, them honey. Lord, boy, what are the people them boy? Then? What are the people them Sunday? Boy, me honey, me this, me that. If the breeze too cool, boy, my pussy wet. One fuck. As them drink a, a boom and, 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 and rum and boom, drink a special, them have to go fuck. But it does a fuck like rabbit. I pay rabbit the boy, you know. Rabbit. Pay a rabbit the boy. Everybody's a rabbit. Fuck does a fling, a fling, a fling, a fling, a fling. No responsibility in a fucking. No responsibility. So when the picnic them come, as I'm gonna I always say, no post tired for me, say this. Definitely slits and glitz. I've not yet seen the weather where it motivates nobody to go work. Like the rain fall, this body man can't spray the car because it's got cruddle. The spray got cruddle. When the sun at him, love it because him can spray and it shine and soak him good. While if the sun too hot and no, no water up on the side, crap can't get so good. That's why me I tell you, say, only the creator would have deal with so much problem and crosses. Only the creator could have deal with so much problem and crosses. Because you do, it's problem. You don't, it's problem. But me that man learn to appreciate life as it comes. If you're not fully ready for any responsibility, don't tell nobody say in a relationship. Relationship is for people who are responsible. You have to be very responsible. You have to be responsible. And if you are fling down sweet fuck, sweet come and go come out of you. Baby, my band sweet. If you're not ready for the sweet baby and the sweet responsibility, leave it alone. Leave it alone. When the sweet day become, all know enough of these people don't take on a responsibility. All right, mama, fall a day, never be about a bean. Not a thing of sardine. See? No, found no. We have a nice cousin, a nice sister, a nice family of foreign. We are work hard. But just because we hear say are foreign, it there, somehow we are telling the cousin about we are beg or something out of our stimulus. I want to beg our sister, I want to beg somebody something out of them stimulus because they get stimulus. And when you go to them and send a hundred dollar come here, you. you're not even grateful for the hundred dollar. You're going to take it and go and do all kinds of things. You see me? I'm a very appreciative person. I don't give nobody nothing to put on. Nobody don't owe me no obligation. Not even my children don't owe me anything. I had sex and took them mother in her pocket and bring them. I took full responsibility of being a dad. And I never stopped being a dad. I've never stopped. I feel good every time I do something for my children. They are not dependent on me anymore. But I always want to be there. Because it's, it brings me great joy. Jolie, it brings me great joy. A lot of people, enough time to watch it. I'm going to see the the girl them way. Keep 
some big posh party for show off on the next girl. Show them baby father and the girl in that things. Them that do it for the pitney, you know, them do it for themselves because if you look back on the party pictures, you look one year old baby, them change the baby three times and them change five times. Them in a more picture than the baby. See them face so beat out and glam out. That's a for them party. I can't have the baby party. If you have the money and can keep the party, no problem. But all I'm saying is make sure that when the party done, you're not in on a problem. If you have beg nobody, nothing and borrow nothing from nobody. Because all of that party something they could have gone wait until the baby get much older. You could have buy a little cake for the baby and the baby will play up night and you sing a little happy birthday. More than you go spend hundred and thousand for a party and then tomorrow here say so you have to borrow money and make something like that. You're supposed to do better now. Don't try to live a big life on a small budget. That no make no sense. You know, if you show up and I say you can buy actually a two thousand dollar phone for you still now. And you buy five phone or ten thousand that. And, and I really want you want the axe still. You want to tell people say, can't remember you know, a seat for myself, enough people want with so much things and show up from people and then they lift for other people phone. Lift for other people phone and I beg money. And the people them attack. Because the people are fed up because the people are saying, look, eh, she just keep a party two days ago. And now she depends on my phone and ask me if I can help her pay her light bill. And I tell me, say, her service, her flow service, if you want to pay her, or did you sell, or did you play one? So the big party where you don't spend how much money and keep. Why you never look for it and say, Mountain I come, and you know, say, me have to do this. So just buy a little cake for the baby. You don't have to worry about people. When the, the child gets older, you can keep a party. You know, if you say every, every, I mean, my one now, I have keep him one year old party, and two now, I have keep him two year old party. So, you have borrow money from this. So, that's why I know for all these, I got forever in a mix up, and I got forever in a couscous and gas gas, and people got forever disrespect, you know. Because you know, get so immune, if you know, learn to wall out, you know, sit down and stress, because you know, see that girl that keep power ranger party, and the one that keep Elmo party. You say you want to keep the whole of Disneyland party. Can you try out do that girl? Why you don't know say that girl eh, somebody keep the party for her? Because she alone never did do it. Everybody loves the baby. So the whole family come in. Cousin buy the bounce about. I want to buy the popcorn machine with the hot dog machine. I want the PFA the clown come. I want them so everybody chip in. The site. So we there in our ass class society nigga. We get fuck. We get fuck. And people of Jamaica. I better we stop coming up on the internet, come comment and say we are cuss. We don't know what to want. We don't know what to want. I know by now everyone knows that they are put like that three point five or three point four percent. Them going to increase the light bill too. So we are going to pay more. Jamaicans, remember, they don't care about the people. They don't care about the people. We are cuss, but we not cuss for the right thing. We are coming, but we not coming the right thing. We have to fight for something. We can't fight for everything. Let's fight and get one thing on a level first, and then we can say, we are get somewhere. But we just make a bag of nice for nothing at all. We are make a bag of nice for nothing at all. A man who never pay light bill yet never have no problem. Them could have raised light to $10,000 every week. 
tak nak apa badai. So, again, I'm going to tell you something, people. Now. The coat of arms, the Jamaica coat of arms, they set out of many, one people. They never have on the two sides say, labor right and pay people. We are Jamaicans. We are one. Them say Columbus discovered Jamaica. Them say the Arawak them, the Spaniards them, them people that discover Jamaica and then them come take it and say ray, 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 and blah, 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 blah. But we get so Americanized, that's nobody don't visit them blood clad. Nobody not talk about Africa again. Not even the rest of them now say they give me a one away ticket for Africa again. When me I grew up, every music, the rest of them used to sing it used to be going on a black star liner. We go into Zion. We used to have up on Black Star Line. Nobody now go up on the blood clad ship again. Unless I cruise them up on weekend cruise or a one week cruise. And the cruise go from this up to go from this up. We are one people. I realize we are in a state now where people who are not vaccinated versus people who are vaccinated. And I see which party it go. Nobody now ask nobody if they have AIDS again. Nobody now ask nobody if they have cancer again. Nobody now ask somebody if they have none of them sickness there again. Everybody now ask you take the vaccine. You now take the vaccine. You now take the vaccine. Remember, you know, people. It's supposed to be each his own. You sit down and you skin out your good wall and your gear, man. You don't know what kind of disease the man have. You run the risk there, you give. Why would you care now who wants the vaccine? Make it just boil long and everybody do what they might do, no man. Leave everybody to make them own decision now. Because at the end of the day, the choice are your one. You are not supposed to end the friendship with me and you be over who is vaxxed and who is unvaxxed. We shouldn't do that part in the world because so much other things are passed with. Vaccine is a distraction. And other things are passed. And other bills are passed. And other things are passed. And we now see them something there. We just step on line and we are cussed. And we say, I took it. And I didn't get any side effects. And I didn't this and I didn't that. While you have some people take it, them fear and never normalize for a long while. For like about three or or, or, or two weeks or whatever. Seeing? Some people get headache and diarrhea. So everybody works different. So I don't know why now we're living in a time where you have to. Nobody now asks you if you eat from morning. Nobody now asks you. Nobody now asks you, you know, what? How you stay financially? Me may go in a business now. What? Me could sell fuck together now. Everybody just want to know what's your vaccination status. So I choose to not into no argument with nobody because every man's supposed to have them choice. Everybody's supposed to have them choice. Jamaicans, Black Americans, Caucasians, Africans, anywhere at all, you know, come from. You know, just stop for a minute and think, no? Just think what is really good for you or what is best for you. Instead of you sitting down 